The moment you've been waiting for has arrived, race fans. Welcome to the championship round. And to make sure the best driver wins, this will be an eight lap series. Driving the Indy 500 Oval and Teal finish, the number four seed from Spanya Lanes, Stephanie Hughes. Driving Mod Rod and Black Trim, the number three seed from Ramu Diecast Racing, Jon Snow. The number two seed, Dale Taylor, is driving Indy Oval in Green Trim. And the number one seed, driving Formula Flashback from Riley's Rally DRC, Mark Taylor. Please note that we have two Taylors in this race, no relation, so I'll be using first names for those two. Beyond that, let's race. Hughes and Snow in the front row. Hughes and Snow leading out Mark and Dale into turn two. Now Snow starting to pull away from Hughes, heading into turn three, still extending his lead. Looks like he's gonna take the victory with Hughes second, and we lost Mark and Dale somewhere back there. Um, oh, they got in gridlock. They got caught in gridlock after turn two. Scoring is five points for first, three for second, two for third, one for last, and a DNF is a zero. Snow and Hughes, one and two. DNFs by the two tailors, but so much more racing to go. Mark and Hughes in the front row. Hughes, Snow, Mark, Dale, single file into turn two. And Snow flips, he's out. Mark slides by. Dale slides by. Hughes is all alone. She'll head to the finish. And Dale's making a late charge, but Mark holds him off for second and third. And there is Snow who slid on down on his roof. So Hughes creating a little separation with that win, but with six laps to go, still plenty of time. Mark and Dale in the front row. Dale Snow leading. Hughes passing Mark on the inside before turn two. Wow. And it's Dale Snow Hughes going into turn three. Still Dale trying to close. Then Hughes. And then Mark is a distant fourth place, I think. Yes, Mark a distant fourth. Hughes still maintaining a lead. Dale is edged closer with that win. Mark is still a lap behind the lead. Snow and Dale in the front row. Snow and Dale jammed up into turn two the entire pack then dale and snow emerge bumper to bumper and hughes and mark they're locked up back there snow accelerating trying an outside pass but dale cuts him off at the finish and hangs on for the win then there's hughes and i think we lost mark back there at turn three boy a tough final for mark almost a dead heat with hughes snow and dale taylor Mark Taylor having a difficult series. He's almost two laps behind the lead. Hughes and Snow in the front row. Hughes leading out the pack, getting bunched up into turn two, coming out of turn two. Now Hughes accelerating, Snow following into turn three, and Snow bearing down on Hughes, left, right, left, right. It's a dog right to the finish, and Hughes takes it, followed by Dale. And we lost Mark back there at turn three. So the extra point advantage of winning the lap really shows with Hughes now three points ahead of Snow and Dale Taylor. Mark Taylor still in single digits. Tough series. Mark and Hughes in the front row. Hughes, Snow, Mark, Dale, single file going into turn two. Hughes still leading, but Snow coming on the inside with this inside pass on turn three, takes the lead and is pulling away for the win. And then Hughes, Mark, and Dale come crashing through. Snow's victory was a big one to stay within a point of Hughes. Dale Taylor slips to a lap behind Hughes. Mark Taylor's chances to win the championship are now gone. Mark and Dale in the front row. Dale, Mark, Snow, Hughes, single file into turn two. Same position. Going into turn three, Mark with an outside pass on Dale, and here comes Hughes, an outside pass on Snow, brilliant move by Hughes, wow. So we'll focus on the leaders, that last second pass by Hughes on Snow gives her a two point advantage with one lap to go. That puts Snow in an almost must win position to either tie or beat Hughes. Snow and Dale in the front row. Snow, Dale, Hughes, Mark, single file into turn two. 
Now Snow is pulling away. Hugh's got to keep up. She's trying to get past Dale. She's got to get second place because if she doesn't, Snow wins the whole thing. Hughes can't close on it. And Snow finishes first. Hughes finishes third. And in spectacular fashion, race fans, the final lap has cast the deciding vote. Snow's three-point lap victory over Hughes has catapulted him to the lead for the second and final time. Congratulations to John Snow of Ramu Diecast Racing. You are the champion of the Slingshot 360 Open Wheel Rally Tournament. Race fans, I hope you had as much fun watching this tournament as I did announcing it. Stay close to this channel because I'm going to have a redemption tournament coming up next. Click like and subscribe so you'll be the first to see it. Check us out on Facebook at Slingshot360 Diecast Racing. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you at the races.